They have just introduced a strange device that some people claim could be the replacement for cell phones. However, the company assures that they do not intend to make a cell phone replacement, but simply a next generation device. We are talking about the Rabbit brand, and this model is called R1. It is a device that has a screen, speakers, microphones, and even a camera that will rotate so that it can become a front or rear camera. But something of the most curious is that it has a physical button to talk to this device. And it also has a physical wheel that you can turn to scroll the screen, even though the screen is also touchscreen. So in a way, you can have an analog interaction with the device to give you a little bit of a vintage feel. The screen is almost always going to show a rabbit in the center, but the funny thing is that this device is based on artificial intelligence. And not only in a large language model, which is what is currently used in applications such as ChatGPT and the like, which are able to understand everything you are saying, but they claim that they have created a large model of actions. This means that their artificial intelligence has learned to interact with the interfaces of different applications. So you simply tell it voice commands and it will automatically translate everything you are saying into taps, apps and more. So it can do a lot more actions than what voice assistants can usually do. During their presentation, they did several demonstrations. For starters, they asked it for information, which is something that generally any other voice assistant would be able to do. However, you can also ask it to play some song and it will immediately run Spotify with all the actions if you have your account linked to Spotify or your favorite music service. Then you could ask it, who wrote that song? or give me the lyrics of that song and other things. But for an even more advanced demonstration, they showed how simply by voice they can request an Uber, and without the device doing too many visible actions, it is actually requesting the Uber just as you requested it. The goal, according to this company, is that you don't have to open an app for every single thing you want to do, and with this, you waste a lot of time. All you have to do is give a voice command to indicate what you want to do, and this device will take care of translating everything you said into actions within all the applications it has available. In fact, through a computer you must link your accounts and Rabbit ensures that they respect your privacy and that the login will be simply on the pages of these services so that they cannot see or store any of your passwords or information. Through this device with a linked account, you could also book flights or ask for more information to organize a trip and other quite advanced things, but all through voice. It incorporates two microphones at the top and that is why it has this physical button so you do not need to say any command to activate the assistant. On the other hand, the camera will also serve you with artificial vision since it can point to a photograph, for example, and if you ask it what it is and it is a music album, it will immediately start playing it or you can also ask it pointing to your refrigerator what you can cook with the things you have there and it will automatically detect the ingredients to suggest some recipes. So, the proposal is really very interesting. At least I find it more interesting than the AI pin that we had seen a few weeks ago, which also tried to be a device of the future, but I honestly did not like it. I like this one much more, but the voice interaction has this complexity that you can make a mistake, and I don't know if the device is going to be able to detect that you made a mistake and correct it, so you would have to be very precise in the directions you are going to give it. Fortunately, this device is not exaggeratedly expensive like other modern alternatives that want to be the future of devices, since it has been announced that its price is $199. On the screen, you see the reference price in other currencies, although remember that the prices here are not the same as those there. Rabbit wanted to emphasize that this device does not require any kind of subscription, unlike other devices that are trying to be the new cell phone. I think the idea is good, and as a first generation, it is well achieved, but I think it could still improve by integrating much higher quality cameras, and I insist that there should be some way to correct if you made a mistake in the command you are telling it. But let me know in the comments what you think and where you think it could be improved.